evening we are currently at the premises of Malam Anyas Jamal Baba concerning his Maoli celebration. So here we have him. We are going to ask him one on one questions about his Maoli. Good evening, Malam. Good evening. Please, if I may ask, what's your name? My name is Anyas. Anyas Jam Ibrahim Jamal Baba. Okay, if I may ask, what is Maoli celebration? Okay, Maoli celebration is uh, we are remembering the Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. The day this, uh, he was born at this very month. We call this month Rabiul Awal. So each and, uh, when Rabiul Awal come, we used to celebrate him. Each and all, any one of the days, we choose any one of the days so that we celebrate him. To remember the gift that Allah gave to us. Uh. So can you um, help us with a verse in the Quran which talks about Maulid celebration? A lot of ayah shows about Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu about Maulid. Allah says, "Lakad kan lakum fi Rasulillahi uswatun asana liman kan yarju Allah wal yawm al akhir." Some, some, some verse also says, uh, there are a, a lot of ayah shows about this, but in short, لَكَدْ مَنَّ اللَّهُ عَلَى الْمُؤْمِنِينَ إِذْ بَعَفَ فِيكُمْ رَسُولًا إِذْ بَعَفَ فِيكُمْ رَسُولًا Allah is telling you that He is the one who gives you Prophet Muhammad. He is, he is the one who is remembering us. To remember the gift that He gave to us. It means Prophet Muhammad is, is, a, is, is a gift to us. So we have to thank God on that. So like our people say, like you, if you send somebody to bring me a bag of, a bag of rice, let's say the bag of rice is 500 cities. When you bring the, 500, uh, the bag, a bag of rice, I know it's 500 cities, but the one who, br who brought that, uh, that rice to me, I can give you five cities, five cities, so that I'm appreciating what you, what, what, what you give to me. You can't compare f uh, 500 cities and, then 50 and five cities, you understand me? Uh -huh. So we are, we are thanking God of what he gave to us, that the Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. Okay, so how many years now have you organized this celebration? This is the, th uh, this is the third time. This is the third time. Yes. We, yes. So, do you do it alone or you do it with the help of some people? Some people are, are, are helping me. Do, those, are, those are cooking the food, those are organizing the, uh, this thing, the chairs. A lot of people, the Malans who are coming to preach, are, a, lot of, a lot of them are coming. It is a work of uh, collect, collective job. It's not, it's not for one person. You understand me? So yes. Can you please tell us some benefits of Maoli. Yes, the benefit is in our belief, the the, uh, the worship that we are uh, watch, watch, worshiping God. We can worship God, then we make a mistake. You understand me? Let's say prayers. You can pray without uh, Allah to accept the prayers because of what, some certain thing that you have done. You understand me? But uh, if you, if you compare the Maulid, the Maulid, if if only you 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 do it, you spend it, your time or your money, it's compulsory. Like a, like compulsory. Try to get benefit on it. You understand me? You are sharing love of Muhammad to other people. Some people don't know about Muhammad, Prophet Muhammad But when you come to and the Maulid, people are going to say something about him so that you take that uh, his uh, uh, character. So what do you have to tell those who, um, some believers of Muslim, they claim um, celebration of um, Malu, Maulid is haram? What do you have to tell them? I can tell them that if only the love of that person called Muhammad Wasallam is in their hearts, they won't ignore it. They won't say no. They find, a, when, where they find a way to say it is good. To remember your son, even your son. When your son reaches uh, 10 years, 5 years, you are celebrating his birthday. You understand me? So what about your uh, this thing, uh, Prophet Muhammad? All the gift Allah give to give to us in this world, Prophet Muhammad is better than that thing. Uh -huh. Whatever, whatever. Let's say in Islam, if God give you a car, you can you can do fasting to thank God. You can prostrate to thank God. You can cook a food to thank God. You understand me? Okay, those things that God give it to you, can you compare that thing to? 
Prophet Muhammad, you can't compare those two. So uh, Prophet Muhammad is, is, is more valuable than those things, you understand me? That's a material world. He's more valuable than them. So if you remember about Prophet Muhammad, you have to thank God. He give it, uh, he give it to Prophet Muhammad Yes. So please, if I may ask, have you met your expectations? More than that. More than that. Less, if I'm expecting people like 20 to come, then I get 200. But thank God for that. Yes. So what advice do you have for the youth out there? The youth out there is, what I'm going to tell them is about uh, learning Islam, Islam, to learn about Quran, to learn Islamic morals, you understand me? There's no uh, misbehave towards uh, our enemies. We have, uh, we have enemies all ever. So we have to uh, behave well, you understand me? We have to behave very well. So that your enemy cannot insult you of your bad behavior. Performers last night have a lot of uh, good behavior and manner. So we have to uh, what? We have to copy him. You understand me? He is our what? Uh, uh, role model. He is our role model. So we have to learn from him. His sober, his respect. You understand me? We have to learn that. So those uh, my uh, my friends and brothers and sisters, they should learn from Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. Thank you very much for having me. Thank you very much.